not too long ago, we discussed 23 Legal's estate plan packages. We introduced these in an attempt to help streamline the estate planning process, but what is this new process? Let's go over it. Come on in and have a seat. I'm Ben Weaver, Illinois attorney and founder of 23 Legal. I provide personal, practical, and professional legal services, and we pride ourselves in our outstanding level of service whenever we assist with a will, trust, or other estate plan documents for our clients. And today, we'll walk you through our process for deciding, writing, and making your estate planning documents official. So, right off the bat, after contacting 23 Legal, we'll schedule an initial meeting to figure out what plan works for you. This meeting usually will happen over a Zoom call, but I'm more than willing to either welcome you into our Rolling Meadows office or meet up with you at a location that makes you comfortable. Traditionally, this can take between 15 and 30 minutes, but sometimes we can get lost in conversation and it can go longer. Either way, it's a low stress meeting to see what fits your life. Once this is done, the 23 legal team starts the process. I pass along some basic information to begin the paperwork and within a day or two, you'll receive an engagement letter and introductory questionnaire. The engagement letter lists our services and fees and the introductory questionnaire will largely consist of basic information about you. Birth dates, addresses, wedding dates, potential beneficiaries, those kinds of things. One other thing the engagement letter lays out along with the fees is how payment is structured. Our payments are usually set out in installments and the first payment is traditionally due right around the time the letter is signed. About a week after the initial payment is received, Adam will reach out to you to schedule a second brief phone interview. The call confirms some details and ties up a few loose ends, which means, you know, getting contact info for the executors or deciding on a backup executor. At the same time, Anne, our paralegal, will start drafting the initial documents to send for review in Wealth Council, which is our estate planning program. Once the documents have been drafted, we'll send a summary for review approval and suggestions to change. We'll then schedule a third meeting, and this time with me again, to discuss the summary. In the course of that meeting, we hash out any final discrepancies that need to be finalized and then modify the final documents to be signed and fully executed. We'll meet one last time to check, verify, and sign those documents. At that point, your work is done. The rest is up to us as we have to deal with some of the governmental agencies that help make that estate plan official. First, if you're transferring the house into a trust, we send the new deed to the county recorder. This helps ensure that the newly drafted estate plan documents line up with what the county and state have on record, so there would be no confusion on who owns what, especially when it comes to land and property. This is maybe the part that takes the longest time, and unfortunately, it's out of our hands. Sometimes the recorder's office can return the documents to us in a couple of weeks. Other times, it's a couple of months. If you ever want to know what the holdup is, please reach out to us and we'll be happy to help with an update. Once the documents have been recorded and returned to our office, there's only one thing left to do, which is to bring the officially notarized and legally recognized estate plan documents over to you. At that point, your estate plan is good to go and you can rest assured that your assets, belongings, and legacy are all in good hands. On a side note, if you ever want to update a will or a trust, we can do that too. Obviously, life changes. For example, your children have children, Maybe a past executor unfortunately passes. Please do not hesitate to contact me and we can update a will or a trust to reflect the current life situation you find yourself in. So that's it from beginning to end how we take care of the estate plan process. Ideally, the entire process takes four to six weeks, assuming the county doesn't hold up any documents longer than expected. We have a separate video on our specific estate plan packages 
so please check the card in the corner if you want more information. If you know someone who is thinking about or needs their estate plan solidified, share this video with them so they can know what exactly we can do for them. Like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to 23 Legal for more real estate and estate planning law content. I'm Ben Weaver, open to taking new contracts to clients, and I'll see you in the next video.